Merry Christmas and welcome back to our channel. Let's get on with today's video. As we've been going on with our videos, we have uh, kind of come to the idea that, you know what? We've enjoyed this. We're coming to the end of the year. And you know, I think it's time to do a top five or so. But anyway, it's kind of our top list of gear that we've worked with, gear that we have reviewed, and we thought it'd be a good idea to kind of do that. So anyways, um, let's kind of get to the top five. I think that we'll start with the very top. So the top of this list is actually more the bottom. Let's start with the bottom of the list because the top is our favorite thing. So at the bottom of this list, we've got the UF-8 by SSL. Great piece of gear. Um, highly recommend go check out our video that we did on it. Um, or if you're just looking for one, they are great. Um, but they're at the bottom of our list because it is kind of bulky. And that's just any controller you get is kind of bulky. So if you're limited on desk space or just in general, it might not be for you. But we love it. Um, the next on that list is the PMCs. Now we do have a pair of PMC Result 6s in here. And we highly recommend them. Um, they sound fantastic. They're very neutral sounding, but they're also very detailed. Um, but they are also, one negative thing, they're, they're very expensive for a home studio monitor. Um, love them. They're very like, natural sounding. They have a very nice center, center image, but they're just a little pricey. So, but still go check that out at that video. And if you like them, go find you a pair. Um, oh, we had a Epiphone Riviera. Loved that guitar. Um, kind of sold it because it wasn't quite um, the sound I was looking for. That's kind of basically what it boiled down to. It was a fantastic guitar, but it was kind of hard to keep in tune. And that floating bridge thing that it's got on the end, the Frequisonic thing that they got going, that was kind of a tricky thing to get around if you weren't used to it. But still, great sounding guitar. And if you like them, go check out our video. There's videos to all of this. Um, what's the next one? Ah. Oh, our favorite thing of all time that I think we've gotten here so far is our WA-251. It's the Warm Audio's version of the Telefunken 251. It's been a great vocal mic here in the studio. We've used it a ton. Highly recommend it. And also we highly recommend the WA WA-1B. They're new opto tube compressor that they have out um, highly recommend it we've done videos on all of these products so but go take a check out on what they look like we love them love both of these things um, I think we'll get to the top of the list here the very top of our list is the ox stomp and the ox box um, the ox stomp is just a little higher than the ox box and why I like the ox stomp is there's so many different sounds that you can get in the ox stomp that are also in the aux box but you don't need an amplifier you can just plug your guitar straight into it straight into your interface or a pair of headphones or something and or a pa if you're doing something like that and have just great sounding guitar caps and amplifiers it's it's kind of a great end piece to a pedal board and if you like um, if you want to see more about that, go check out the video we did on how it sounds. We did like, this is how it sounds video, and you'll kind of get a gist of, of how it can sound and some of its settings. Um, and then the aux box we love for various reasons as well. We love hooking our amplifiers into it and recording amps through it, and it just makes life so much easier. Um, if you want to get like a two, two mic type thing, you can mic your cabinet or you can you can also send it through the aux and record it direct in. Um, it's great for those who are in bedroom studios and don't have the space to have a big cabinet um, or neighbors who allow it. So, um, but I think that's kind of the, the list that we've got for the year. Um, we're gonna keep going on with more videos throughout the year as 2023 wraps up and as 2024 kind of continues on um, whenever it goes. But uh, we would like to thank everybody who has liked and subscribed. And, you know, if you haven't, do so. We noticed a lot of people who watch our videos haven't subscribed. So if you like our content or think we're funny or interesting or just weird, um, and you want to pass it along, do so. 
hit the like and subscribe. And you know what? Go make some music, and we'll see you next time. Merry Christmas.